Hi my beauties and welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new here then hi my name is Ankita and hopefully from the title below you people might have already uh, judged that today's video is all about my vanity. I am going to share my makeup collection with you all. So first of all I'd like to uh, clarify that I never uploaded like it's been 8 months since I've been blogging and uh, I haven't uploaded my makeup collection yet because it's not way too huge like literally I've seen beauty bloggers who have makeup collections which is like exclusively extensively huge like you can't explain in words how a beautiful amazing and expensive exclusive makeup collection beauty bloggers do have and I don't have anything like that I wasn't having anything like that but yet a few of you were continuously following me on my Facebook and were continuously requesting me to share with you all my makeup collection and I didn't wanted you people to feel like I'm not fulfilling what you people want me to do so that's why I am uploading it so please don't mind if you people feel like I don't have a very huge collection but yet I do have more than what an average normal girl would have so if you people think it's way too much then I'm sorry and if you people think it's less than yet I am sorry so if you enjoy watching such type of videos because I love watching makeup collection and storage videos so if you people love watching such type of videos then please keep on watching and don't let me know how did this video fare for you all don't forget to follow me on all my social media I have a Facebook and Instagram and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you people haven't already and don't forget to give this video a massive thumbs up so that you people do let me know how you all love me and uh, soon I'm gonna reach 100 subscribers so do let me help do help me in extending my family over here and with that being said let's not just blabber a lot because this video is gonna be a bit more longer than I usually do so without wasting any more time of your alls let's just straight away show you all what all I have got in my makeup collection so this is how my vanity looks like from uh, top to bottom and if you people are wondering that was the mirror so this thing is rotatable and here is the mirror you guys so let me start off with the foundations this is known as foundation heaven as a termed by me so the first thing that you can see here is this Pons BB cream and it's lying upside down for some apparent reasons then I have this LA girl pro BB cream I have the Maybelline BB cream then I have this Insure BB cream which has a brain of its own it doesn't ever wants to stand still so it's lying out there then I have uh, this foundation from Lacme this is the perfecting skin something something foundation and then I have this Maybelline's fit me foundation right there then I have my L'Oreal infallible foundation then I have my Chamber Sheer Delight foundation this came along with this foundation in my bridal vanity and that reminds me if you people want to see what I uh, did had in my bridal vanity then you just have to comment below and I love to share with you all then this is NYX matte but not flat foundation it's, it's a little bit darker for my skin tone then this is the Freedom Pro uh, matte foundation I don't know why they have termed it matte because it's absolutely not matte then this is L'Oreal matte 12 hour stay finish foundation I have a review for it on my channel it would be linked in the bottom bar so if you people haven't seen it yet then please don't forget to check it out as well then this is the Lacme Absolute mineral skin natural finish mousse foundation very very long name this is one of my favorite foundation if you people follow me regularly you people might have already known that and this is my setting spray this is by LA girl this is their pro setting spray I don't use setting sprays a lot because I love using my rose water more than anything else when it comes up to setting up my base makeup as you people might have observed already then coming up to the next row as you guys can see I have my concealers over here so I have some Freedom Pro stick concealer I have NYX concealer then I have Maybelline Fit Me concealer I have LA Girl Pro concealer and then the bronzer for the sake of bronzing as well as then I have uh, this NYX wonder stick for bronzing in the shade universal if I am not wrong no this is in the shade deep then I have this LA girl pro setting HD finish powder 
and uh, yes and this is the lacme absolutes loose powder and if you people follow me regularly you people might have known that these are summers so these two are my current favorites then this is my love like my cherished love the most loved thing this is my nyx conceal correct and contour palette then this is my la girl pro hd setting powder and let me show you if it decides to come out this is it and then i have this chamber sheer delight compact powder and it's still in its packaging like it's one and a half years old but i love keeping my stuff in pack their packagings like respective post packagings then i have this freedom pro uh, translucent setting powder i used to love it a lot but often uh, like uh, two days back i did dropped it somehow and it broke into million of tiny pieces if you guys can see and uh, then i have this uh, highlighter this one is by makeup revolution i know it's not that much of an hiked up highlighter but this looks amazing this is like a crazily pigmented you guys just have a look at it it's amazing it's really really beautiful if you people don't have it this is something that it's worth investing in then i have this lacme's blusher the blush sing uh, the single blushes are right here kept right here so this is the lacme absolutes blush and this one is by color bar this is the uh, blusher come uh, eye shadow pigment you can use it like both for both the things then coming up to the next drawer which is the last drawer in this section i have two perfumes lying here rest of the perfumes are in my bathroom because i love using my perfumes while my body is wet i don't know for some apparent reasons then these two uh, containers contain all my brushes these are my eye makeup brushes and these are my base face makeup brushes already and then me being married to a hindu male the significance of that is right lying right there these are the sindoor bottles of mine and they have the sindoor in them then coming up right over here i have this cute uh, little manicure kit kept here it's just for the sake of looking pretty it's lying over there it is of no use otherwise it was gifted to me by a friend of mine uh, my wrist watch lying back over there i just love keeping it on uh, the dresser itself because it's just amazing to have it right there it's way too convenient then this uh, small glass has all my eyeliners and kajals and all stuff like that uh, the stuff that makes your eyes look more beautiful i have just kept kept it right there so uh, this is my nikas am black kajal liner this is like my absolute copper finished eyeliner then this is my maybelline's uh, colossal eyeliner then this is my maybelline's uh, hyper matte eyeliner this one is the rimmel scandalized eyeliner if you people know me and follow me regularly people might have known this is one of my favorites then this is my lacme absolute kajal pencil this is some random kajal pencil which was gifted to me then this is my lacme absolute eyeliner this one is the maybelline vivid and smooth eyeliner in the shade ocean blue this is my colossal kajal and then this is the nikas rock the line kajal and this one is by faces their uh, their kajal and that and that finishes off the top section it's just my skin care and hair care left but i'll be coming back to it later on let me first just show you uh, the bottom drawer this is the last drawer that i'm showing you guys first i hope you all can see and observe clearly it's visual to you all so there in the back in this transparent box i have all my mascaras kept that are in use at the moment so i have my my, my colossal card mascara maybelline slash sensational mascara l'oreal's uh, false lashes butterfly mascara chambord's mascara and then i have my maybelline's push up drama lashes mascara i love keeping them in one single place like a box like so it's just way too convenient for me to pick it up and you know understand what is where then there you can see some q-tips right there i love keeping them with my eye makeup because it's just way too convenient to keep them like that let me just take it out so that i can show you guys the rest of the things very clearly then there you can see my false lashes i don't have way too many like i have only two pairs of them and i'm practicing them that's why i don't feel the need of them like being excessive of them then there uh, you can see the adhesive duo 
dew that is kept right there then here we have uh, my la girl go glam uh, face palette there's the bronzer highlighter and blusher palette then i have my freedom pro contour and highlight palette as you guys know this is one of my uh, favorite favorite for palette to go ahead with this is the pro stroke then this is the uh, what do you call it this is the pro blush palette from freedom this is amazing i love using it if you people follow me regularly you people might have already known then uh, this is my uh, these are the eyeshadows that i have kept there so this is my c at london's eyeshadow palette then i have a nyx eyeshadow palette keep it right there then i have this freedom pro eyeshadow palette i have the lacme absolute french rose eyeshadow palette and then i have this modern renaissance and uh, by abh i have this uh, what do you call this this is makeup revolutions i heart chocolate palette this is makeup revolutions 32 eyeshadow palettes this is amazing i have like literally forgotten how beautiful it looks i should remind myself of using this more into my videos this eyeshadow was amazing it was in my bridal vanity as well these are the shades that are available i love this thing about makeup revolutions packaging that they always do provide the shades at the back these are the shades of uh, i have chocolate palette as well and then i have the balm meat matte eyeshadow palette this is meat matte nudes eyeshadow palette the best mattes i have ever came across then this is the la girls nudes eyeshadow palette that i've kept right there it's just way too much more convenient of having you having the taller ones over there and the smaller ones right here then coming up to this side here you can see my inglot eyeshadow base then this is the nyx smudger eyeliner then i have this freedom pro dip brow pomade lying there then i have this uh, c at london's eyeshadow pigment right there then i have these singles by makeup obsession so i have this highlighter that is the bare lights then i have this uh, contour cream contouring shade right here i have a review on them so if you people haven't seen it just go ahead and check it out i'll link it for you all then this is the eyeshadow this is emerald eyeshadow it has very beautiful glitters in it it's amazing then i have this azure eyeshadow this is a very beautiful blue i just bought it for the sake of blue only i didn't need it an additional eyeshadow but still it was just blue then this is the contour uh, contouring powder okay so this is how it looks when it is like you know arranged properly so the second drawer looks somewhat like this so it has all my sponges here lying down and then this is the compact sponge and i use it for makeup wiping because it's useless as a compact sponge then this is my maybelline's push up drama lashes mascara backup i love that mascara so much that i love keeping a backup for it and in the meanwhile i did made all the lipsticks that was for that were fallen upside and the funny part is that when i started collecting there were only five lipsticks and now it's nearly filled with them but the place that was empty i've just used it to store my nail paints so these are this one is by lacme these are by these four are by nika these are reds a few were uh, just you know a gift from nika a few were purchased by me and uh, then these are the maybelline's color show uh, nail paints these three and i'm not a nail paint a huge nail paints person so these are the only these are the number of nail paints that i do have then this is a nail paint remover and then coming up to my lipstick this one is the sugar smudge me not lip crayon and then this is uh, the maybelline color sensation lip gradation thing then there you can uh, see just wait for a moment. And then these are the Nykaa's crayons, lip crayons, three lip crayons uh, uh, sitting upside down. Just making sure the lipstick from the back don't fall in the front. 
then uh, this one okay. sensation lipstick in the shade pink these two are by lacme these two are by lacme the gold radiance range one is orange edge and one is pink peon and then this one is by uh, revelon this is their red this is the most subtle red i've came across till date then this is the lacme's uh, satin lipstick in the shade red this one is by nyx this is by makeup revolution then uh, this lipstick is by maybelline there you go the matte range from them these uh, two are by gala from london i've reviewed them on, them on my channel if you people haven't watched it i'll link it in the biography just uh, wait for that just go don't forget to check that out as well then this one is by maybelline this is the 14 hour super long stays very very long name lipstick and then these six are the organic sticks lipsticks of mine i'm going to review them soon on my channel i'm just waiting for the time the right time to come across then this one is by l'oreal these three are the cans collection 2014 by l'oreal these are the exclusive pinks these three are the exclusive pinks by l'oreal these three are by nika they're so mart range the winter fall collection then these three are by avon this is uh, the next uh, lipstick in the shade sable i uh, love this then this is a lip balm a random lip balm lying over there this one is by maybelline then these are like like my absolute mousse uh, lip and cheek tints and these two are la girls lip glosses and uh, these two are next liquid lipsticks one in the shade copenhagen and one in the shade monte carlo and then this is the mua lux range liquid lipstick this is a lacme absolutes lip gloss i'm not a huge lip gloss person you won't find a lot of lip glosses in my vanity this is the chambers waterproof uh, a very very long lame liquid lipstick in the shade 482 this is like transfer proof kiss proof it's just amazing then these two are by c at london these two have been reviewed by me on my channel as well so this ends the first drawer as well now coming up to my skincare and hair care section when you open it up like this this is how it looks when you give it a closer look so here you can see my plum face mask lying over here it's something that i love using so i just love keeping it right in the front this is the second bottle of it and when it will finish i'll buy the third of it as well it is loved by me a lot this is the moisturizing cream then this is the nivea moisturizing cream this one is pons age miracle cream this was gifted to me uh, on my wedding that's why it's kept here and i haven't used it at all because i don't think i am old enough to use anti-aging products right now then there is bio oil kept there without which i can't live my life because i love applying it while i sleep sometimes when my skin is misbehaving like it's not in its best shape then this is the johnson's baby skincare cream i love applying it onto my hands it's amazing and this is my makeup remover by maybelline one of the most essential things that i have then here is my body oil oops i dropped it has the body oil that i love using a lot then this is my uh, toner by fab fab india this is my rose water bottle it's just an a random bottle and it has dabo gulabri rose water in it it's just convenient to use that's why it's placed there then these two are my moisturizers by neutrogena this one is uh, for combination skin and this one is for uh, oily skin and there at the back you can see my pons loose powder i just love having it for my underarms it's just very helpful then there is the dabo gulabri uh, gulab gel water bottle the largest size of it then here you can see my sunscreen this one is by neutrogena this is my favorite sunscreen and then uh, this is the patanjali's aloe vera gel i love using this for as a primer as well as uh, you know uh, for moisturizing as well so this covers the uh, second shelf the first shelf is all about the hair care thing and for some apparent reason i don't know why i forgot i just kept my uh, what uh, this face wash right here this one is by neutrogena as well this should be kept right here so come back to where you belong and there is the nivea uh, balm after shape balm i use i love using this as a primer then there is live on hair again this one is for my husband and this is the khadi uh, hair oil 
that is what I love and this one is the L'Oreal nourishing hair oil this is the L'Oreal hair repair serum this one is the Pastanjali Skeshkanti oil and those two are badam oils that are kept right there and then coming up then coming up to the last drawer this has uh, my bangle set arranged over here I love this place it's just it has a very different sentimental value for me this is a vanity tray this one was in my bridal uh, vanity and uh, where I have just keep kept some uh, random stuff in it let me just open it up and show you guys this is the band you people might have been capable of observing it it uh, usually uh, I use it when I do my makeup videos then here you can see all my bindis placed over here these are the uh, symbol of me being married then here you can see my Nykaa's sharpeners and my sugar's sharpener and I don't know then here you can see some random small stuff lying over here this is my cello tape this is my plucker I love using it while I apply my falsies and uh, then you have some bobby pins some rubber bands some safety pins lying around here so this is what is kept in it then here you can see my lip liners and next two NYX jumbo eye pencils over here so I have two shades of it one is cobalt and one is gold and then I am not a huge lip liner person yet I do have some of them this one is by Maybelline this one is by Lacme this is very neutral very beautiful neutral shade this is uh, a Lacme iconic, iconic kajals uh, I'm tired I can't speak Ni Lacme iconic kajal as a backup and this is a random lip liner and this lip liner is by NYX I'm not a huge lip liner person as you people might have already known so this is it what is there in this section of my vanity and closed so i hope you all have enjoyed it if, and if you did then please don't forget to give this video a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you people haven't already and uh, with that being said let me not just waste any more time of yours like this video was uh, way too long i wasn't expecting this to be this long as it has been but since it has then i am so very sorry and let's just wind it up right here and i'll see you guys in my next next video till then stay blessed Bye.